we're excited! <laughs> we're inside because it's <laughs> cold and snowy out. We did snow removal, but now what we're gonna do is <sighs> we're gonna take all this wood over here that uh, we bundled yesterday, all the cedar, and we're gonna put it back into the trailer. We're gonna take it back to Kenny's wood yard, and then we're gonna load up the trailer again with another load and come back and bundle again, because it's crappy outside and it's yes. windy and blowing. And I got a logging job to do, but we got 10 other things that gotta get done Yeah, first. there's a lot of other stuff to and do. I'm kinda so. crippled up with a bad knee, and so we're like, we're just trying. Right now, we just wanna be inside where it's nice. Yeah. Well, so we're thinking, since the bundler's here, we're going to bundle some more wood. Right. So we'll, we'll bundle basically a year's worth of it's wood gonna for It's going to probably be a year's worth. Yeah. We're going to haul this back over there, cover it up with a tarp so the sun doesn't rot the plastic. Yep. And then we'll have another pile like this in here, which I will leave in here for probably a week to make sure it's dry dry. Right. And then I'll move some of it outside a little bit at a time. But it got my tarp kind of blew off, so some of it got snowed on and rained on and froze and... I mean, it's been in a pile dry for two or three years already. Yeah, this this uh, cedar is so really, really, really light, dry yeah, stuff. Yeah, it's about the lightest thing you're ever. But for hand. starting a fire, it's the best thing there is. Yeah, it's nice. It's really nice. So, so yeah, we're just gonna handle our wood. This is our leftover debris over. from yesterday. We're just gonna throw that That's into the. Not very the much for the whole trailer load. Nope, nope, nope. There's probably a few sticks in there. And I actually, when I cut this stuff, I sat long enough. I peeled most of the logs before I even split them, so no kidding. there's almost no bark in all that. It's pure wood. Yeah, I yeah, paid for is. the bark, but I'm not selling the bark. It's clean. Yeah, yeah it's really good wood. It's uh, good kindling Top for Top notch, sure. and I sell it dirt cheap. cheap. Yep. Stupidly cheap. Well, let's load her up. Yep. Okay, so for your entertainment value, <laughs> we have moved wood from here to there. Last night, we moved it from there to here. <laughs> and now we're gonna go unload it and handle it again. <laughs> and then throw another load in. And why is that? For your entertainment, we like touching wood. <laughs> so yeah, no, we, we uh, made the executive decision that I don't need this wood till next summer. And right. it doesn't need to be in here and dry for a week. Right. So we're gonna bring another load while Chris is here with the bundler right. and take advantage of it being here, brute force. What's his name? Justin? Jason? What's his name? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> All I know is you guys uh, got to get me a processor up here. I got a lot of wood to do. We'll, uh, we'll get a processor up here. But yeah, this thing worked just awesome. Once we got the hang of it, we flew. Well, we once flew. you got to get a rhythm going, you know, it was the first time for me, but yeah. Yeah, what, what else can you do on a go cold winter night, you know? Yeah, no. we're going to do another so one. We're so going to yeah. do another one tonight. You see the space? This is how much void we have here. We didn't put much of a crest on. We had on, a pretty good crown on it when we brought it even in. up front here, it's pretty empty. There's, I mean, it's not full. We had it really, really heaped. Because in general, I found, from what everybody's told me, what I found, too, is you lose about 20 to 25% of your volume throwing wood in loose versus stacked. But we're going to go do it again. So okay, yep. let's dry off and go do it again. We're gonna do a little maintenance here. As long as we're in here, it's warmed up, it's dry, the grease is warm. I tried greasing with a lot of battery, it doesn't work. It doesn't, <laughs> I can't pull my figure them on and paint things, I squeeze that. So yeah, this trailer's got grease fittings on the shackles, which is awesome. Uh, back here. Right, the go? That's our dump hinge right here. And our hinges all got fittings on here. Kind of nice. It don't take much. A couple pumps. I've never used this yet, but you got fuel in there. Yeah, I gotta keep her greased, even though I'll probably never use the dump, but you never know. Why let moisture get in there? Right. I'm only doing this because every time I touch the trail, I get grease on my hands and then on my clothes. It's so much fun being full of grease all the time. You can wipe it all off once you get it done. Let me touch something. We're in here. Uh, let's see, I got a 
couple on the hoist here. I got a couple on there. Yeah, a lot of times one. I gotta get, I gotta run it up to get at those sometimes. But I think I'm out of grease. I'm not clicking anymore. Oh, I'm out of grease. Yeah, you got yep. one down inside of there, I see. Yeah, there's, actually, I think there's one here, mm -hmm. one here, one there. I think there's three. Yeah, you might have to run it up a I'm bit. I'm dripping with sweat right now. It's because it's a thousand degrees in here. Well, we're going to bring the tractor in while we're gone to get that thawed out.
Today, it's another brute force Woo! wrapping day. <laughs> so in the last video we did of wrapping, that would have been a day or two ago that you guys saw it, but we're here three days in a row I'm here, so you're gonna have videos kind of with me and Ken doing stuff for yeah, lunch, but. Stuff. We did wrapping yesterday. We did what, 165 we counted bundles. Yep, yep. And we took it to his yard. And then we loaded up this load here and uh, we brought it in. I can feel the cold coming off of it. We figured we'd take advantage of the wrapper being here. I'm like, yeah. yeah. As soon as I brought the wrapper and I brought him a case of wrap, we're gonna use it up and we're gonna, we're gonna no, wrap. No, we're not gonna use it all, but. Well, we used two rolls This already. should carry me for quite a while. This will, we'll use all this roll. We'll probably yeah. do the last roll. And this is a lot drier wood than what we yeah. brought home last night. It was wet, juicy, ice yeah. covered. Yeah. Well, it so got this, rained on and everything. This right. stuff is covered. Yeah. This was covered very well. But so. it's all a year over a year old. I mean, oh, there's nothing some of this stuff. This is, is about as light as a pencil. Some of it, yeah, that's <laughs> maybe two pencils, but that's not much there. No. So, yeah, we're liking the wrapper. It works good. We finally got a system worked out yesterday that we put three, four in the bottom. And then, uh, we, the put, then we put the, the wrap in, like everybody told me to do. Put the wrap across like that, and then we put in another. I don't know. The bundles we made yesterday were a little too big, right? For what I normally make. So today we're going to. Today make we want to keep it about to that well. We want right? to keep them right in the bottom of that lettering. Right. We were going. We kept right. putting too much. Well, in. there's these notches here, but you don't really notice those. I'm right. just kind of going by the. Hey, that's probably a good, good enough, just like yeah, that. Yeah, right? a couple little bitty ones maybe, but that's it right there. So then we do our wrap. Whoa! Slow down. We've been doing three, and we find it works fastest just to take your fingers and snap it off. You'll see it when we get going yeah, here. Chris has got it down. I don't have it down. I open my fingers and I just jam them into the into the stretch, but we'll fill this up. Yeah, it goes pretty quick once we get going here. Well, with two people too, because it's about as fast as you can go. Yeah. And we found obviously you got to adjust your tension and your roll, whether it's full or just about empty. And once it gets warmed up, we found it, it came off a lot easier right. too. Got to, we had to kind of adjust a few times there. I wish I could bend over. That's too big. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it right there. There you go. Yeah, when the two of us together, we just can fly, so. Yeah, when he's standing with a camera like that, we don't get much done. Nope.
maker. That's going to be it. Crap. Here for we can just throw it on the floor, yeah. We're going to change your bundle if we finish this one. Here we go. Anchor? Doubt it. Just keep going. Just keep going. You're right there. There it is. Okay, so you could conceivably bundle out to 24 inches. I guess you could lay them way out here if you wanted, but. Yeah, you could do 24. 24, 20s, and then if you slide it in. As far as it'll go, 16, 16 inches, yeah. Is your shortest, so I mean, you know, I got some short stuff, you just put it in the middle of the bundle, big Right, deal. right. So yeah, we empty the trailer out, put a new, uh, Take a wrap on here. Roll on. We figure we did, well, the pile over here is probably 140-ish, 140-ish, yeah. something like that. Not as many as yesterday because the trailer wasn't quite as full. Yeah, but we did, I'd say over 300. Yeah, a little over 300, that'd be and my guess. How many hours, too. about three hours? Maybe, yeah. Well, that's two of us, so, but. Two of us, and that's not counting loading it. Because, you know, we, that's right, just doing right. the wrapping. We had to go load it and then bring it here, but it's nice working in the nice warm garage, that's for sure. So shout out to the guys from Brute Force. Yep, yep, they uh, let me Brute use Force it. FB-16, woo! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there it is. It's uh, very nice, very fast. You wouldn't want it to be any faster. You gotta no, keep your, no. You gotta keep your hand, your elbows kind of level here because if you get your arm up in there, it come around and kind of whack you. She's pretty quick. It's very quick, yeah. I like it. Like it a lot. Yes, works really good. Uh, Chris is going to leave it for me. <laughs> well, I got to do some bundling yet with it too. But yeah, we, that's why I brought it up because Ken didn't have a bundler and I, I knew he had all this to do. So I might have enough for a year. Or, yeah, it'll be a lot there. Even a half a year. See, and Ken only sells at his house here, so he doesn't yeah. have any locations. But if he did, he probably would sell a lot more. Now, they've got notches cut here where I think this is 0.75, this notch. And then this must be one. That must be 125, and that's probably 150, I'm guessing. I don't know, I didn't get a, a manual with it, but we were pretty much going right to the bottom of where it says brute here. And, right, and, and last probably, night we were going to the top, so I right. gave away a lot of wood on those bundles. But Yeah, so bigger bundles, smaller bundles, but. I just sell bundles. They want to pick through the pile, I don't care. Yeah. I mentioned this before, I don't care. It's not, right. I'm not the picky. <laughs> right. It's bundled. Yeah, it's a bundle of wood. But if you're selling commercially, you'd want to be pretty accurate and put your label in there with your name and right, right. all that. But Hotsy totsy. There she is. Now we're going to leave this wood in here for what? You think maybe? I'm oh, I'll leave this in here for a month if I want. It'll but be until, cool. until I figure it's in my way. And this is about as good as a kil kiln as you can get because that baby puts out some smash oh, special Oh, I can heat. keep it 90 in here all day if I wanted. Yeah, it's, well, we got to throw some wood in there. And then I, I put the fan over there. You got to put some wood in That's there. That's for like when we're trapping, you know, that fan there. So yeah, we just grab a pile of these and whip them in there. There you go. Open up the draft. So overall, we like it. It works great. And we finally got a pretty good system with two people. You can really fly with this yeah. thing, so. Takes the longest to walk from here to there. there. Right, right. A conveyor belt would be. Oh, yeah. Well, obviously. How much Anything. you want to spend? You how know. much do you want to spend and how much work do you want to do? And right. yeah, it worked really good. Tomorrow well, we got a logging job. We do. So yeah, I'm up at Ken's for three days and uh, we did two, three videos a day. So you're going to see a whole bunch of this stuff. So tomorrow we're going outside and trees are going to die. That's the yep. plan. So see you tomorrow. Good night, Irene. Mm -hmm.